Hi everybody, hope you guys are doing fine, you are doing great. Uh, today is yet another day uh, with another circus of the day <laughs> with this little one here. Let's see you. Uh, so today, uh, first of all, welcome back to my channel. No, baby, come here. Welcome back to this channel where we discuss about different issues on child development, on brain development, and this is a very crucial topic that I love, and we are continuing on it. Uh, last time we were looking on brain development, how it happens and how it occurs. So today we are going to look at some stages of brain development. Some interesting topic. So come closer and let's learn together. As I've said, I like learning and I like sharing. So if I learn something, then I share something. So come and let's learn together and share together. Don't mind about him. He's a little bit uh, disturbing, but I have to just do the, the recording. Uh, yeah, today we're going to look at uh, brain development. We're going to look at stages of, uh, of brain development. You know, everything has got a stage. And here in particularly, here particularly we are going to look on baby's brain development. How does it occur? And what are the stages from which stage to, to, to which one? So we are going to look at uh, around five stages. No, no, no. We're going to look at five, around five stages on where the the on baby's uh, brain development. First of all, it occurs it occurs in several in several stages throughout life. So we're going to look at five five four aspects on the stages of uh, brain development. And the other one, the first one, we're going to look first of all of prenatal prenatal development, brain development during infancy, during childhood. No, you're disturbing. During childhood, during adolescence. No. Mama's recording. So all these stages, they they play a very greater role in baby's brain development. So let's just jump in and look at uh, the, the first stage, the first stage of baby's development. And here it begins from actually the conception and it lasts through through uh, until birth. So here we're going to look at some rapid development of brain because the, here it's where the formation of neurons in those neural tubes, the neural connection, the neural pro, uh, proliferate, I don't know the pronunciation, but those formation. And uh, they migrate to, to each neural system, each profiliate, they, they migrate uh, and locate in their appropriate uh, place on the, on, the, on, in the, on the brain. So this, this stage is vulnerable to environment influences, such as nutrition, such as toxics, such as maternal stress, because here it's where the baby is inside the womb. So it's all those information, those are all those formation, the neural tubes and all that, it's where they are forming. So if the mother, here when the mother is pregnant and the mother is being stressed, the nutrition is poor, everything is uh, having mm. maternal stress, no, don't put that on the mouth, please. All this they will affect all they will affect the development of the brain to uh, of the baby uh, let's look at another 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 stage another stage is uh, during infancy now here the baby has been born uh, properly the brain is okay so but it is continuing to be, the the brain here continues and here when i'm talking about infancy i talk about around zero to, to two years here's where the brain continues to grow and it grows rapidly not only growing rapidly, but it continues to form in a very astonishing rate. Because here now the baby has grown, uh, everything is uh, taking place at a very uh, rapid, I can say rapid or astonishing rate, or a very, how can I put this? But everything forms in a very rapid, uh, rapid, uh, rapid uh, pace. So I can say that in this period, what's up? I'm recording. Don't disturb. Sour? Okay. So what was I saying? In this period, the brain is uh, growing growing in a significant significant is it significant 
of development of the the brain so here the milestone the milestone can include the motor skills the milestone can include language acquisition the milestone can be uh, social emotional uh, development the sensory exper experience we are going to look at something called sensory experiences we are going to look at this uh, sensor what are they they all play a crucial role in shaping the neural connection during infancy. So you say that the baby is already born, but still the brain continues developing rapidly. The growth goes rapidly. Things of motor skills, think of language acquisition, the, how the baby learns the language, the social emotion, how do you how do you uh, get attachment to your baby? All this during that time of zero to two years the brain continues growing but then let's look at the early childhood early child here i'm talking about two to six years uh in this stage it's characterized by the continuous growth the continuous growth in language cognitive skills the brain cap the brain capacity for learning the uh, the, the the memory here expands the children begins to to develop uh, a more complex problem solving abilities uh abilities social skills also develop uh, in this in this stage uh, a child uh, develops that sense of interaction with the peers or sometimes with adults they uh, they listen to adults at their what the adults are saying they listen to to several things at this uh, at this particular period of time so find that here the from from 0 to 2 is different from 6 from 2 to 6 so all this stage, the, 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 the development continues to, 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 to develop. But then let's look at uh, uh, let's look at another 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 stage whereby after looking for after from two to six, let us look at from now uh, six to twelve years. What happens? So you say that during this stage, the brain undergoes refinement and specialization of neural circuits now the cognitive abilities such as uh, attention such as memory such as executive functions all these they continue to to improve so this period is critical for academic learning now now the child has gone to school the child is learning the development of self regulation the development of uh, emotions uh, how they control the emotions how they grow up and think how they think their thinking capacity has grown uh, their social uh, network has grown so all this has started from the, the from the brain so the brain continues to develop so I find that from from infancy it's different from zero to two it's different from two to six it's different from six to twelve and at the end from adolescence now what happens at the adolescent age does the brain stop growing no, the brain continues grow, uh, growing, but here now the the, the brain goes uh, undergoes some changes of complex things, thinking capacities, learning becomes more expanded. Everything becomes in a in a how can I put this? Like the interaction, choosing what friends to have, choosing uh, what what lessons uh, or subjects to take, uh, my circle of friendships and everything. So all this in adolescent and adult, adolescent period is where the brain now starts to figure out what is good, what is bad. And also in this period is whereby also peer pressure sometimes. You find some... Uh, curiosity that curiosity they want to try things they want to test things so you find even here they sometimes they, they uh, some adolescents are led of doing bad things like maybe drug addicts uh, pornography and things like that but it's where now the brain has expanded it needs to learn things it needs to know this it needs to to do this so you find that in this stage uh, everything is connected together and the, and the learning and everything things are moving like that so today we have just looked at this uh, a few stages of brain development hope you hope you have learned something i've talked about from prenatal to infancy to childhood and then adolescence so hope you have gotten something for today thank you bye